This is a toaster, just upside down now. I have a situation here with the wire, and as you can see, it uh, melted. So I cut it. I try to fix it with electrical tape, but it gets bread crumb breadcrumbs in it, and it's just disgusting. And it, uh, the glue on it runs, and it softens, and it's not working. So I thought I'm gonna put these ones on it. How uh, these things work is uh, you put the wires in it and you crimp it. Problem is that some of these have uh, you know have been used. You can see that there. You can see that they used to be round on the inside. Here's a new one. Just see if I can do it with one hand. There, that's a that's a new one, perfectly round and nice. So you put the wires in it from both sides and sorry. So you put the wires in from from both sides one for one side the other for the other and then it's uh, and then you crimp it with your wire stripper you can crimp it there that's your crimper a uh, little spur but uh, all right I want to use this one and I want to use this one but the wire doesn't go into them because they are they have been used they have been crimped ones but then the wire got ripped out of it so what I'm going to do is, you can see that this end is a little bigger than the other end, and yes, that's why I have the nail here. Here is my mini work anvil. Just let's just call it an anvil, okay? And so here is my hammer. My, my hammer, and you see where it's going. Find the nail that uh, that does go in. Tap on it and. Um, put it back to its original shape and then it's good to go again alright or you can just buy a pack of these for 149 but what if the store is closed and you do need two of them like right now so you can just fix it with a nail like so a metal nail not my nail my, that, that one alright and two minutes later there we have it so the metal insert slipped out of the plastic sleeve and yes I'm aware Michelangelo did a finer job there it's back to round-ish so it's gonna slip back into its plastic sleeve and then oh, come back here and then I can crimp it again with my crimper jolly good takes two minutes or so tops well, I lost a little bit of the length on the plastic but there we go you can see that it's there you can see that it's done well a little chewed up nah, kinda kinda unsafe but uh, hey I can I can do just one wrap with the electrical tape so it doesn't become this disgusting pile of crumbs and plastic and glue so just just one wrap around it you know so that it's got doesn't have uh, exposed um, metal on it or it doesn't come into accidentally contact with the lid